you know, I'm kind of emotional, so some of, you, some of you people may have known me when I was an athlete here in Michigan State, and I was uh, brash, wild, crazy. All of those things uh, describe what a sprinter is supposed to be to be a success. Um, but today, that's not the story. The story today is I'd like to thank the Hall of Fame Selection Committee for, <laughs> for this prestigious honor. I'm, I've been crying for the last 20 or 30 minutes. Some of, some of you think that I've slighted you, I walked past you, some of the people who are truly my friends, you know who you are. Some of you think I'm blowed up, I'm not blowed up. I'm just caught up with emotions, okay? I mean, it's only 93 people in the Hall of Fame, okay? And I'm one of them, you know? So if you can't understand that, of all the people that have been through Michigan State over the last 150 years, then, you know, you really need to take a reality check yourself, okay? Now, back to the speech. Uh, good morning, Spartans fans, former and future Spartans. I'd like to thank the Hall of Fame Selection Committee for this prestigious honor. First, I'd like to apologize to my mother for not being, for being a bad son, okay? Um, I know you have had to endure because I didn't finish the task at hand. Children, Marco, Marshall, Marquita, Kayron, Janelle, Michael, and Mark, you know, I... Um, I wasn't there for your birthdays. I wasn't there for your graduations. I wasn't there when you had your first little mishap girls. But you know what? I'm here now. And I, you know, I just want to say to you guys that I love you. And I just really am sorry for any hardship or anything that I caused you guys. But if you guys know me now, you know that's not who I am. I don't care about anybody that think they know me. How much time have you spent with me? When have you been to church with me? Okay? I mean, I'm just standing up here now just uh, ad-libbing. I got a speech in front of me, but I, it's some people that really think they know me. But spend some time with me. Come to church with me. See me in a different light. You know, then you'll, then you'll really be able to appreciate who I am today. This honor that I'm receiving today for some things that I did back in the day, and I really appreciate that. Um, firstborn, you know, I love you unconditionally. I mean, there's, there's, nothing, there's nothing I wouldn't do or say for you. You know how I feel about you. If you don't, I'm telling you, I love you. Uh, Greg Thrasher, you know, I just thank you for, for all the letters you wrote to the Michigan State Hall of, uh, Hall of Fame Committee over the years. Herb, thanks for being you, man. You know, you just, uh, you just really made me better. You know, I came here a, a fantastic finisher, but you made me a complete athlete, and you... Uh, you opened my eyes up to a lot of things that I was really in the dark about, and I really want to thank you. I want to thank you for the statements you made last year. When, uh, I really appreciate you, and I love you. Okay, Coach Bibbs and Miss Bibbs, you guys, um, when I first came back to town, you guys uh, picked me up, put me under your wing, and just, um, you, I guess you guys thought that I had some hate or some animosity toward either one of you. I did not have anything but love and respect for you. I love and respect you both right now. Okay. Fambro, friends agree, or friends agree to disagree, okay? In my world, I don't, I don't know what about your world, but in my world, you, uh, you already know what you've done for me. I can never say en enough for what you've done for me to keep me alive and responsible. You know, I'll always love you and respect you for that. When we played football together, you know, it, it, was, it was two against nine. It was two against 11 all the time, week after week. It was two against 11, okay? Some of you people don't realize that when I played football in Detroit Northern, it was Keel Deal. That was the call. That was the call. Mr. Fambro was my blocking guard. Him and I went down together. We won together. We lost together. So I just want to know. I know you and I have been going through a few things, but know this, that I love you. I hope that you love me as well. Uh, Ronnie, Ron, Ronnie, I've been knowing you since 71. Keep on keeping on. Ray, we've been through a lot. We've been all over the country together. You're my, you're my guy. Ron and Carmen, you're my Lansing friends. Ron and Carmen, where are you? Okay, you're my Lansing friends. Yes, I have some white friends too. <laughs> okay. Uh, Pastor Jan and Chucky, thanks for being, uh, being led by the Holy Spirit. You guys uh, live the life that God wants us all to live. Being honest to the word, full of love and quick to repent. I love you both naturally and spiritually. Jan John L., my last born. Just continue to try it, everything you do and you'll eventually climb that mountain. Spartan family, I have to say thanks to a true Spartan fan, for real, and a Marshall Deal fan, Charles, Charlie Abraham. Charlie, 
you have been just a true inspiration to me. Had I not, had I not met you and you had not been my friend, I wouldn't be standing up here today. Thank you very much for all the love and kindness you've shown me and my family over the last five years. Now, I work at, I'm a volunteer coach at Lansing Community College, I'm, and I'm wrapping up. I'm a volunteer coach at Lansing Community College, and uh, I'm on state disability. I, may, I receive 264 a month. That's what I've been living on the last five years. So I want you to know that some of you look at me and think that I'm dressed up in this nice suit. Someone out there bless me with this, okay? And I'd just really like to thank the Spartan family. If there is a George Webster scholarship out there available, would you please put my name next to it? Thank you very much. <laughs>